This meeting is being recorded. Hello, today me and my teammate are going to present our assignment about project planning, about setting up a restaurant on Tujunga Street. <clears throat> first is about, first is the stage one. about the external environment. Restaurants with prices that can be enjoyed by many people are very few, and the number I saw there were only two or three, and the rest were just hotels there. So we want to build a restaurant that can be enjoyed by all circles and tourist-friendly. Second is about the location. The location of Jalan Tunjungan is the main road that is often passed by many visitors. This will be a great location to make a profit as long as it's a good place to visit there. And then next is a tourist destination. Because it's only known as the central street of Surabaya and historical place there, many tourists come to walk on Jalan Tunjungan. That's why I think uh, we need a better stopover to enjoy the roads there. Next is uh, the internal environment. Uh, I have sufficient connections in connecting cooperation with parties who are willing to help in the business process so that uh, my profits will increase according to the amount more if this is successful. And then next is, uh, although there is of setting up a restaurant there is quite large because the land price and capital are like large. But we are willing to build a, a great restaurant there. And then uh, last is about ability to run business. I'm really sure that I'm ready to run this business because I believe I have sufficient ability to manage this restaurant. Next, next is about the stakeholders criteria. The first is it must be a friend or a person who can be understood and trusted in carrying out the agreed tax or contract. And then must have a good performance and intend to complete the with responsibilities. And the last is open in mind and able to be a person who deserves to be helped in his goals. Next is about prioritize stakeholders. The stakeholders that I prioritize is who are able to assist the business in satisfying customers as well as monitoring the economic situation and setting the prices that will be installed for doing business because I think that can be a great support for my business. And the last is about understand key stakeholders. The most useful and trusted shareholders who is a priority in carrying out my plan because if he asks for help, it is certain that the business will be helped even more. I can help shareholders in the form of investment and others as long as it doesn't ruin my plans because I have the principle, guess is a king. So uh, here, as you can see, we have uh, two kinds of stakeholders. The first is the owner. There are senior executive, co-workers and team. And next, the second stakeholders is the shareholders. There will be alliance partners, suppliers, and lenders. Next slide will be explained by Kerry. Okay, thank you. Next is about the objectives. So the purpose. The purpose of this project is to make the restaurant more accessible to all people, as well as and live in the atmosphere of Jalan Tunjungan, if it succeeds in making this restaurant known to everyone in Surabaya. 
we are really hope that in this project we can make this restaurant as good as tourist spot as well as a good place to be visited by all people who are in the restaurant and our success criteria are first to make food suitable for all circles and the quality in the restaurants needs to be improved in the form of cleanliness safety service and comfort second this will be a form of trust from people or customer that to make this place more known by many people with many people's recommendations for this restaurant it will make the restaurant to be recognized as a tourist spot for visitors on Jalan Tunjungan. Next. Next is the scope about dust and tones. The dust. Okay, we make sure uh, to have a training for the trim to make sure that everyone uh, understand and on how to manage the project in order to carry out the project according to the target. And we also make sure that the stakeholders and all the team inside this project understand about what the project is and what are we trying to tell them. Next, we also receive all the feedbacks for the project for improvisation. We also raise issues right away when they happen during the project. And about the tones, the preparation taking longer than expected that cause the comments can be delayed. So we are trying to avoid that. And the poor communication make the project team is unclear about the goals and the project. And we cannot deliver the, deliver the information properly. Improper management can make the project messy or even fail. So expect to be able to manage the team and the plan. Next, the stage three will be explained by Alvin. Okay, thank you, Nicholas. So I will explain the stage three. So in this project, the planning there will be five process. So the first is identify activity. In this activity, I do it in stage and can change based on the future or current situation. So first, I practice, practice my delicious food and how to manage the employees at the restaurant. Second, I conduct uh, an experiment or experiment with the resource of the food from the opening day of the restaurant, as well as making further plan if it succeeded in attracting a lot of visitor interest. Next, we'll continue to adapt to change into the food business and make conditions profitable for each other. If this plan is successful, we'll then will a lot of recognition it will recognize by visitor as a delicious culinary tourism spot. And the second is estimate time of and resource. We are not really sure about the time in the process of working on this project because there will always be as there. My plan does put too much to emphasis on the time limit there, so it will take a long time to make a profit. But I'm target this project for at least um, 12 months resource in raw material. I also rely on the connection or market situation. If the connection it is in the raw material, it is provided the best quality material and the price is also in accordance with its performance. I consider this is an evidence because this business must also be able to benefit its, its customer. The next slide, please. Okay, the, the, the three is identify relationship and dependencies. 
in this side of here, what is a mod needs is efficiency and work as a trigger for customer for confidence and enjoy the food there. In order, make healthy and delicious food, recipe in a friendly manner for our seeker and the BBB. Next, uh, form a team of the corporation intending how to cooperate in the process of service to customer and we will continue to analyze the performance to customer. And the next is, if it's successfully tested by many people, it will make it easier to achieve its goal of expanding the business and become, become a culinary tourism destination. And the four is identify schedule constraints. The time limit to, to estimate time of the project. Problem in resource for the work will occur if the food manage human as well as connection in the reaching resource are in trouble. Also, if there are poor management of the project, then my target will be difficult to achieve. Next slide is five shape the schedule to be able to back up in this plan are first keep editing and making decision and uh, second look for opportunity to make connection that can help you to achieve your goal and the team make not only the test of food as mainstream as well but make a place as hang out or take picture or less there. And the uh, four is make this discount price is more profitable to run. Thank you for your watching presentation. Have a nice day all.